my name is Britz Robbins. I am a social media manager and coach for a small business. One of my largest clients is Shambhala Music Festival in Salmo, British Columbia. And I've been working with them on their social media since 2008. Um, how do you use social media at your event? Um, there's a couple different ways we use social media. Um, we use social media throughout the year to keep our audience engaged, keep the festival at front of mind, um, share images with them from the festival to keep them excited about the event. And then on the grounds, we also do things like uh, live tweeting, live photo updates. Um, we have a photography team of about uh, 10 different people. And so they deliver us five um, of their best shots every day. And we, we're pushing those out um, live during the festival, which actually um, we did see. We, we only do um, day passes on the Sunday, the last day of our festival. And we did actually see um, a fairly dramatic increase um, in our attendance on the Sunday because we were creating a, a little bit of a FOMO effect. Uh, for those of you who don't know what FOMO is, that's fear of missing out. <laughs> Can you say something about the social media strategy? Yeah, so Shambhala's social media strategy is um, its a component of our overall marketing strategy. Um, and it's really just about um, meeting people where they're at um, in the digital space and communicating with them one-on-one -on -one and, um, and creating those relationships and connections that make the people feel um, like the festival cares about them and wanting them to come back. So how do you engage with your audience throughout the year? So your festival takes place once a year, one weekend, the rest of the 51 weeks. How do you engage with them? Uh, we um, we do a lot of uh, con content creation of our own, of course, um, because we are a music festival. Um, we have this really great opportunity to release um, music from the festival. Um, a lot of the stage directors uh, record the DJ sets throughout the week um, of our festival and they'll give us the uh, recordings of that and we release those on our SoundCloud. Um, we do interviews with artists. We put up a lot, we have a huge photo library. Um, so we make sure that we put out a photo every day, um, just to keep the festival on people's minds. And, um, everyone loves finding a picture where they're in it. Um, so we do share a lot of pictures of the crowd or people um, with, in groups with their friends with their fancy costumes on. And um, it's just a, it's a really feel good thing that makes people feel like they're part of a community.